It could be considered St. George's version of America's Got Talent. Maybe develop something that they didn't really realize, you know, how wonderful they are. Over a dozen would-be performers showcase their talents by singing, playing, and even dancing their way on the Star Search stage. It's all part of the 4th of July celebration events in downtown St. George. There's a uh, 4K race that starts at 6.30 in the morning. And then there's a parade at 7.45, and then everybody heads into downtown to the town square, and then the talent show starts. Hamilton is one of three judges vetting the talent for the show. Never, I've never done theater. Ranging in ages from 13 to 84, these performers are all dedicated to their talents. At age 13, Emma Hale is a natural. She not only sings and plays the guitar, but most recently learned how to play the harmonica. And so we found the harmonica and in my mom's room. And I just started picking up, trying to find some songs, you know. Um, and I ended up finding a song that I could play on the guitar and play with harmonica. So I just played it and I picked it up easily, so. Most of these performers just love music. People don't understand how music will change how you feel, will change what you feel. Like, you know, people with video games, you know how they are? They're just addicted, and I'm just addicted to music. I just do whatever. I just love singing so much. It makes me so much, so it brings me so much joy. And I have children, and I feel like I just do a lot for them, so I wanted to do something for me. And The only dance performer, Enya says she loves to dance. Oh, well, my talent today was a form of dance using silk bell fans. And, you know, when I was a little kid, I did some dancing. But then I went a long time not dancing, and it makes me happy. So that's what I should do, and that's what I'm doing now. But some perform for other reasons. I went over to her and I said, Honey, how old are you? She said, can you keep a secret? She said, I'm 92 and don't you tell him because he doesn't know how old I am. <laughs> I started at 82 doing stand-up comedy um, full time. I used to sing, I used to write music, but I lost my hearing, I'm almost deaf. So I decided maybe I can do comedy. I only need a one-side conversation. <laughs> this threesome likes to combine medleys. Have a fan club, yeah. Oh, yeah definitely. <laughs> My mom and grandma are already a part of it. Yes. <laughs> and even families will join in the competition. All chosen to perform will compete before a panel of judges for cash prizes. Competing for cash and prizes, uh, courtesy of our wonderful sponsor, State Bank of Southern Utah, which provides uh, the funding for us to get trophies and gift cards and things for our, our finalists. And no matter what their talents, you won't want to miss out on this exciting stage performance. We have about 14 competitors this year, and uh, the show starts at 10.30 on July 4th, and it will go until uh, about noontime. In St. George, Melissa Anderson, Community Education News.